Mika Lipstrew is an occupational therapist at Fort England and one of the main facilitators of the Fort England Art Exhibition, which has been present at festivals since 2014. The project is about providing a space for people to experience themselves as something other than a patient, to experience themselves as creative beings. There, there are so many facets to a person that tend to get lost um, in the context of an institution. Fia van Tondo is also an OT and says that the mental health service users, most of whom have never been to school or picked up a paintbrush, have improved since the project's inception. We had a guy who could only draw the outlines of a car and he uses a, a black pencil for that. And then one day he picked up a paintbrush and he did still just the outlines of a car but it was in a different colour and it was a paintbrush and not a pencil. And it sounds silly, but that's a big thing for him. Humza Makaleni, one of the OTs at Tower Hospital, says it's her first time coming to the National Arts Festival and is impressed with the patients. I can see the quality of work. It's, it's, it's right on par with the rest of the established um, painters. And I feel like um, the users have accomplished something by showcasing here. Both hospitals rely on contributions from benefactors and the money that they make from selling the art, says Shannon Smith, a Tower Hospital OT. Some of the supplies come from our rehab fund, um, but otherwise, yeah, we also just rely on donations. And also the money we make from selling the paintings, 50% goes towards buying material for the following year. The Fort England Art Exhibition will be at the Steve Beaker Building every day from 9 to 5 during festival.